Alexis Bigfoot Thomas was still a member of the Royal Police Force when he attempted to rob Paradise Casino at gunpoint in 2014. He was convicted by a jury a year later and sentenced to 23 years in prison for the offense. On Tuesday, Thomas' attorney argued the sentence was excessive, given his client's age and other factors, including Thomas' previous good character. Director of Public Prosecution Anthony Armstrong agreed the sentence should be amended on the basis that the trial judge erred in principle when he handed down the sentence. The DPP opined and the Justices of Appeal agreed the judge appeared to have been influenced by a mandatory minimum sentence imposed by Parliament. These stipulations are found open by the court as a limited judge's power of discretion. The DPP added the sentence fell outside the normal range of sentences for such offences in the jurisdiction and suggested a range of 15 to 18 years. The Court of Appeal subsequently reduced the sentence from 23 to 18 years. However, grounds put forward by the appellant to have the conviction quashed were dismissed by the court. In another case, a man who was sentenced to 25 years for raping a 15-year-old girl has been released from prison on bail pending a new trial. The Court of Appeal quashed the man's conviction Tuesday after DPP Anthony Armstrong conceded that the trial judge erred when he permitted the defendant's wife to be compelled to testify against her husband at the trial. The rule of marital privilege disallows a wife from giving evidence against her husband. The appellant, who had been on bail prior to his conviction in 2015, has been released on the same terms as his previous bond. I am Jamie J. Roche reporting for ABS News.